Hello and welcome back to Pathologic Tomb. You may remember at the end of last time, everything kind of fell apart and just just went to shit. People died, and um, the more people are infected and I can't I can't save anyone. <sighs> Not getting infected again. I might have to, you know, something. Um, I'm gonna really just buckle down on who I want to save. I want to save the kids. I want to save Griff, and I want to save Lara. And anyone else, if I can, I will. But I don't think saving everyone is really going to be much of an option anymore. Um, the dead item shop is open, so we're going to go in there. And we're going to see what we can do. Okay, we need a spindle. I'll see if I can loot something on the way way there. Um, we'll see if we can get something in the dead item shop. We might be able to get a powder. And some evenings get, kids gather at the station and this type of people are meeting at Saba's place. Okay, so we've got some stuff to do. We've got a lot of stuff to do, actually. <coughs> uh, well, hopefully, at least by trading away some of the bandages and stuff, we've got a something we can be getting on with. I I don't want to get into big fights with my lancet because I do want to keep the lancet. I'm going to need it later. I, I know I am. Uh. Okay. Well, I mean, that'll have to do. I don't want to kill him. Not immediately. At any rate, um, right, we're going to go in here, we're going to loot what we can, we're going to get out, if there's anything of value to be gained. I don't know if there will be, I, I doubt that there is. Better than nothing. Someone knows I'm here. Ah, oh, shoot. Okay, everything's kind of just going a bit wrong here. This district is infected. Oh, fuck. Okay, right, well, we go to the dead item shop, we try and protect Lara. Lara? Uh, Lara? Um, Yulia. Yulia is... Yulia's valid. Yulia can... Yulia, I want to keep safe. Yulia is a valid girl. My fellow traveler, look what I have here. Curious thing. A belt, huh? Used to have one like it. So many children says straight with this belt. Parental authority is unbroken. They have a special way of educating kids. Cruel, but efficient, don't you think? Father never hit me. Yeah, look at this crack. It wasn't his fault, it was the cat, but the parental response was to teach a lesson. He could have tricked them, sure, but the parent would have got him by the collar anyway. That face. So distant, so indignant. I love such faces. They're funny. You truly are a master of your work, Rack and Bone Man. Fuck it. Uh... What we want? Neomycium? Can always use more antibiotics. I have no use for revolver ammo now. I have some food, but it's probably not going to be enough. We're five short. I'll do. 
Thank you. Okay, deep breath, guys. Okay, we go to Lara's. I'm, I'm in no mood to get infected again. We're not going to live if we do. People having punch-ups in the streets is not really going to help me. Fuck it. Immunity's too low to be dicking around. Okay. Yulia. <sighs> Which day are we on? Day eight. I think the old Gimskis might be in danger again. I hope Lara was, was going to be okay. I think Lara's district is burnt out now. Right, okay, down in, down here. We just... What do we do? We do we just make a, a run of it? Do we just try and run straight? I guess we have to. I don't really see another valid option. I do not want to get more infection burning onto me. Okay, the Tanners. I'm respected well enough in the Tanners. The Tanners is safe? Is this a safe district? Are we... Ah, oh, sweet walnuts. Uh, okay, you know something? Okay. Walnuts. And some other items. Shoot, um, I don't really want a bloody bandage. Uh, I'm gonna just use the egg and I'm gonna, um, done. Nope, nothing there. Okay, shoot, okay. Um, what's our options? We go down. I just want to spend the last what I want to deal with this thing with Anna. She'll give me a heart if she gets a spindle. Is a is a is a heart worth it? Still broken. Okay. We're going to go to the termitary. Probably not a good decision, but... I don't really know what other choice we have. There are too many infected. I, I don't have the means to give... to save them all. I'm fairly sure that... Some of them are going to die on the way. Uh, we also need to start dropping off a whole bunch of inventory loot. Grocery, pharmacy, grocery, clothes. I can probably afford to uh, to buy something to upgrade my inventory. It's just um a cloak that I need, I think. Okay. Cow, my cow, my kingdom for a cow. Okay, onwards and inwards. <sighs> the machine is. Lad? Yeah. Happy now. I 
didn't expect you'd actually come. That wasn't enough. I sent people to seize him and drag him to my place, but he was long gone. So I came here to rescue the boy. But he wasn't here either. So you risked everything for your son. Help me get out of here, will you? I'll try. I'll, I'll lead the kin away from here. That's what it was all about anyway. I feel bad. Vlad was not a nice man by any means, but... Is this what he ended? Is this how he deserves to end? You brought him. Good. Now you will become responsible for us. Fat Vlad was a bad master. You will be better. You will take care of us with your life. Listen to Bodho's will. Listen to Suok's chant. Do what we will. Fine. I will become your father. I will take care of my people. I promise. Bekada, these are the right words. You truly do know the lines. I'm sure. I kept my word. I brought you all Gimski. Now let the girl go. Didn't we tell you she cannot be cut away for us? Do you fear for her? We'll take her with us to Shechem as soon as we can. Neither the town nor the sand pest can touch us there. You... Why are you still here then? I'll speak to the Inquisitor on your behalf. I'll let her know you're only going to Shechem and not further. The schism grew among us because of you, Emshin. We can't go anywhere. Split. We are a single body. We cannot leave a limb behind. It will not let us grow into a new life. Remember what Mother told you about fingers. Because of me. How? Some of us reject your authority. They hate you. They blame you. Your father for everything. They will never accept you. We cannot leave this place torn asunder. Kill them so that we may be whole again. I'll need a weapon. Numerous they are. We have no weapons. But you know the lions. Ah, oh, fuck. Where are those apostates of yours? We will lock ourselves in our rooms now, preparing. The disloyal ones will keep wandering about, skulking in the shadows with their plots. We'll open the doors again when the schism is no more, and then we will go to Shechem. This is blackmail. Okay, this is not good, because I, okay, okay, I don't have the health to do this, this will kill me. Christ, I think we're going to have to come back here. Get one hit on me, I'm down. So I must skulk in the shadows as well and knife them in the back. God damn it. <sighs> Must you? Hunger comes into play. Hunger it is then. And let me remind you, your health continues to dwindle. Well, such are the rules. With each new mistake, every time you come to this stage... This is no stage, it's a like gallows. Fuck me. Right? Hunger it is then. <laughs> Shit. Oh, 
Okay. A different decision must be made, or at least a different set of decisions. Ones which are perhaps more sensible. I'm not going to go and fuck that up in the same way again. At least I'd rather not if I could avoid it. What are you doing? What is going on here? Okay. Right. We are not in a position to keep fighting. We're in a position to go in and mug what we can. We, we just take stuff from the houses. We trade back at the dead item shop and we go. This is... I'm not the nope, maybe not. Christ. Why must everything be so hard? No, 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 no. <sighs> okay. Stop throwing... Stop, stop throwing Molotov cocktails at me. I'm not your goddamn enemy. Well, they aren't throwing them at me anymore, I guess, because I'm not obviously infected. Right. So. Okay. We, we, we do this trade again. <laughs> A valid enough trade. You little weasel, what what now? No. Please don't think this is about capturing agony. I'm not the kind to burn models alive and attempt to right a truthful suffering. My interests lie elsewhere. It's not about cruelty or the inevitability of the end, the triumph of death. All of that is only a reason, an excuse. I was dead. Now I'm alive. Who are you to make me come back all the time? What kind of trickery is this? We're meeting for the first time. Although you do have some features in common with your predecessor. For the first time. What do you mean? Who are you? I'm an impresario. I only hire actors, that's all. When one of you dies, I handle the replacement. Why? What do you mean, why? To finish the run, of course. That's not what I mean. Every time I come here, you say it gets harder. Well, the previous rehearsal was, uh, unsuccessful. So now we play rough. There's more malice in the world. This will not, cannot change. Adversity makes people strive. If the goal of your play is to overcome death, the invincible foe, why make that more difficult? To avoid complacency. Complacency is death. It will drag you into the abyss. The very abyss that we are trying to overcome. So how do you intend to do this? I need different actors to continue the same path, each starting where the previous died, so their interpretation of the character carries on. Here's my question. When does the actor become the character? When they get into character, the actor goes out into the town searching for inspiration, a role. He walks down his paths. That is what you are about to do. Why can't... Why do this in the town? Why are you not here in the theatre where you can see? Because outside the walls of the theatre, the triumph of death is real. That's why you must act there, not here. Why isn't the stage enough? Because I don't care about your emotions, only your understanding. If the actor understands how to work with death, so will others, like me. Don't worry, though. In truth, what you see out there is but a stage, too. It's also a model, like the one in the background behind me. What do you want? What do I want? A good play. No one's ever staged this one before. You must break away from your limits. I'm interested in that, too. Push the limits of a theatrical stage, of drama, of form. Push the actor beyond their role. 
the play itself, beyond this sorry theatre. In that, uh, in that, Mark Immortal, our goals align. Said I, the player. Once more unto the breach, dear friends, and fill the gap with stepland dead. Okay. Wait, did those fuckers leave me with less health? Uh, I don't... This is not good. This is all not good. I had... I was... I was alive. I could do this. I had the chance. I... No. No bullets. Bullets do nothing. Time for loot. And if we die... Stab him in the back. Stoy. Torje, torje, torje. I deserve more. Well, oh, he was hiding more then. I think I got very lucky there. Right. We're not gonna make that same mistake again now, are we? Nope, no, 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 no. He's got infected, he's got infected. Nothing is good about this place. Okay. We don't fuck around this time. I'm sorry man, dying on the street, you're just gonna have to die there. This time, this time we do this, this time we win. Okay. a lot of water bottles to give. Fine. Is there anything else that I can get for eight? A bullet. A single bullet. Well, I mean, I can trade a bullet, I guess. Fuck, my immunity is blitzing down fast.
Okay, right. Take it. Just, just take it. Okay, this time we save the game here and we don't, f we don't fucking die again. We run straight across and down. Do you reckon that we've got enough health to that once it's gonna break? Okay. Uh, 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 mm, mm. They're not following me. I don't know who they were or whether they were friend or foe. I mean, no one's a friend in this town anymore. Right. Not bad. Decent trade items. I really wanted a spindle, though. That's what I was after. Uh. Okay. Um. Okay, just down we go. Down we go. No more fucking around. How many times have I said that now? How many times have I said no more fucking around and then what do I immediately, immediately just proceed to do? Everything just keeps falling to darkness and I don't think I can... Shops might. Uh, shops? Yeah, actually, yeah, there, there is a shop here. Fuck it. There is a shop here. I might be able to trade something. I might be able to. Uh, I just. Really? I just want want another scalpel. Actually, that's that's what I actually want. And this is a grocery, not, not a pharmacy. I kind of have missed my shot. But let's see. Oh, coup coupons. Um, Ooh, these coupons are quite limited, actually. I'm going to need to be careful how I use them. Well, not for now, at any rate. I've not got the space. Ah, fuck it. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna see if there's some fucker in one of these houses that will let me in. And let me talk to them and, like, go, hey, can I... Can you sharpen my goddamn scalpel? I just want it... I just want it fixed. Kid, what can you give me? That'll do. Hey. Uh, I mean, I want to, who repairs the scalpels? Who repairs scalpels and bladed instruments? Not this dude, but... Okay.
none of these dudes can repair my scaffolds. Are there any other types of dude around? This woman. There's no one else in this house. Okay. I don't want my scalpel to break as soon as I've killed the first Adonk. And I get the feeling it probably will. Christ, this is just not going. <coughs> not going how I want it to. Um, okay, we'll just have a quick look around. And if there's no one I can immediately spot that would repair anything that I have. Right. No, 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 no. Okay, right. We'll do this in a different order. Okay, I'm planning a different route. We go down, we talk to Saba, we go to our lair, we dump stuff, we pick up stuff, we tr we just trade out this entire inventory. Um, why? Why? Why do I never have enough? Well, I mean, I've got a grindstone, so that'll probably just have to do for now. Uh, no. Okay, fuck it. We're doing this in a different order, and uh, I fear I've just wasted time. I think I might have got enough deaths to now get into the death spiral, though, and that is certainly not a position I want to be in. Is that a grocery? Okay. Loads of water. sound kind of scary. Right outside her house. Right outside. Oh, that's fucking cruel. <sighs> we want to ask our money. How we can we deny ourselves? My body won't let me forget it. I can't stop loving myself whilst I still have a body. You can try to deny yourself all you want, but why stop loving yourself? I don't know, but I can tell it's a hindrance. I want to ask Saba of this. Let her teach me. Curious question indeed. I wish to abandon my name, so did my family. The Estege, the Abge, the Basagan, the Akshan. Why would we need names? We are no one. Hell, you refer to each other then. We do not need names to call upon each other. We do not need words. I want to ask our mother if we lose anything vital by shedding names. You want to abandon your name, but you still refer to yourself with I. Shouldn't you start with that? I want to ask our mother about our speech. This foreign tongue impedes us. It slows our minds. How can we refuse it? Speak the step tongue. But it's too bare. Too many new things in life that have no names in the step tongue. Invent new words. 
that is how you can serve our people. Ah, oh, fuck. Ah, oh, fuck, I forgot she was infected. Where's the clock? Well, uh, fine. Nothing else new here, but we know a little bit about the kin. Stop waiting outside for me. That's not nice. Oh. This is so unfair. I mean, it's entirely apt for... Hey, look, my bull. Hello. Look, he's back. Where have you been, stranger? Don't leave me again, alright? I'll have to tell you. If you knew exactly what went on here, you wouldn't have come back. Well, maybe that is exactly the reason that you did. Hmm. I've got a bull. Can I use the bull for blood? Oh, Christ. Everything just keeps falling apart. Okay. We have some potential. Hello. What are you doing here? I came here to talk to you on Saba's behalf, Yargitian. I am her rough hand, her wise heart, her heavy word. I'm listening. Saba would have said many words, wise words. I am bad at speech. My words are simple. You have come into your father's inheritance. You are a man who the kin acknowledge you as a Burach. This is what matters. Okay, my exhaustion is up. My exhaustion is up? Was it... Did I... Did I screw up? Or... Was it always relatively high? Right, okay. You know what we're going to do? This is what we're going to do. Okay, that makes it a little bit nicer to, to load in. Okay. Okay, right. Now we load out. We have a lot to a lot to deal with here. Swavery, Ash and Swish, Brown Twire, Black Twire. We've got a lot of twire. We've got a series of antibiotics. We have a panacea, we're gonna keep the panacea here. Powder, I'm gonna keep the powder on me and probably misuse it again. We've got a bullet, we've got a... Okay. What other items can I trade out? Um... Hmm. Eh. Right, what, are we, what do we see on the map? Really? The other side of the town? Fine. He was fucking dead. Fuck. Um. Oh, God. I've had a bit too much to drink. Why must this... Oh, dear. Maybe I shouldn't have drunk that. Who knows? I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. It's fine. I'm fine. I am fine. I am entirely 100% fine. I'm distinctly not tripping balls right now. Okay. Um, inventory management is perhaps not entirely needed here. Uh, okay. Uh, bloody brown, brown, black, swevery. Uh, I think swevery is green, isn't it? Ashen swish is orange. Um, uh, okay, we're gonna make a whole bunch more of the positive medral tinctures because that is what will save uh, at least some of us. One, two, three. Okay, it stacks at 10. We put this one back. Um, cool. Right, now we need 
more tinctures. We need, I'm gonna make at least five of each. So brown and blood make uh, a white. Three, four, five. Brown and black make an orange. One, two, no, nope, they make a green. Brown and black. Just because I got blood and black. Oh, whoops. That's fine. Okay, and brown and black. I need more water. Okay. I'm gonna keep at least one water bottle just of my own. Um. Okay. Okay, Sticky, have you got anything to say? No. Okay, we save the game here. And we're not infected, so we can just sleep for three hours. I'll probably at least get off the worst of the exhaustion. dreaming. But where am I? This is the stage. Ну, конечно же, это же кожа. Потому что кожа это про прикосновение. Ты же кожей соприкасаешься с миром. Это твоя граница. Вот, это слово и прозвучало. Граница. Граница это про мозг. Все, что нас ограничивает, рождается в голове. Империи себе максимум империум эст. Вы друг друга не слышите, и никто никого не слышит. А все-таки главное это органы и кровь, потому что кровь это связь. А прикосновение это перемены. Ты можешь изменить человека только тогда, когда коснешься его. В нем изменится все, а он даже и не заметит. Так значит, ты сторонница хитрости. Откуда ты такая взялась? Нет, я не люблю хитрить. Я люблю трогать вещи, оставлять на них крохотные частички себя и смотреть, смотреть, как они преображаются. Ты не изменишь человека вопреки его воле. Только воля имеет значение. Это опять подтверждает, что самое важное — кровь. Кровь — это всего лишь поток красных и белых частиц. Да, у них тоже есть информация. Но разве что-то сравнится с великолепием мозга? Решайте быстрее. Город умрет. Не умрет. Я же умею творить чудеса. Развяжите мне руки. Хватит держать меня, ну... Вечно вы оба играете против меня. Играете? Мы с тобой что-то в игрушки играем? Вчера погибло 914 человек. 922. Завтра счет перевалит за тысячу. Нохуин дуну РТОП. Вот. В этом и разница. Для вас это числа. Нули с единицами. А это живые люди. К ним прикоснулась чужая воля. Они уже живые. Нет, похоже, мы не договоримся. Времени у нас мало осталось. Расходимся? Расходимся. Как обычно. Сколько у нас там осталось? Одиннадцать дней? Расходимся. Время пошло. This is familiar to me.
deep do these rifts go? Christ, none of this is going well. Okay. Uh, okay, I think we have a rough idea as to what we should do. Plan our route. We need to plan our route. Okay. That's Pity's Hospice, the Broken Heart Workshop. I need to give antibiotics to these guys. I'm... I want to cure Notkin. There's too many people infected. Everything's kind of just gone wrong. Um... What can I do? What can what can I do? Which way to go? This way? One up, two, three, four. Is that the best route? How many people does that let me save at once? Okay. One, two, I'm right by three people I can potentially save. One, two, three. I have to do it this way. Saving people is probably more important. Isn't it? Okay. My bullfriend is a friend. Okay. Oh, good lord. Time for some... Time to save. Let's try this. Are we ready? I'm keeping those tinctures in hand. Sweet. This is too dangerous to go into the middle of, but I need to loot the houses. I need to get something to defend myself. I've got plenty of coin. But we are running dangerously low on other supplies. Okay, let's be careful. Better than nothing. The rotten food is not a good idea to take. Is there anything in that now? It's on the floor. Let's just be careful, nice and slow. We remain careful and nobody sees us. 
then I can get away with this without fighting. And if I don't have to fight, nobody has to die. And if nobody has to die, maybe this town's going to do a little bit better. I mean, for the dead item shop, it may be useful, but... That'll do. I didn't sharpen my stone. Okay. I should have start sharpened my scalpel whilst I was at home. What do you need to sharpen a scalpel? be in there. You can just keep on looting. Okay, I think we're good. We just we've got a decent enough hole. We now we now just leave. One down. Okay, that was fine. We need some more kit though, and I'm not prepared to Something. Something's gone scruffy there. Okay, I think they're fighting each other upstairs. As long as I just stay... Nice and calm, in the shadows, in the quiet, I think we might be able to make it through this. Ugh. Not worth it. It's always the risk that you take though, isn't it? Most of these houses, there's nothing in them. But every so often you get something handy. What I'm hoping... Okay. <coughs> oh, nice, 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 nice. Okay, what time is it now? Nine. I spent a good two hours pissing about with this. I need to probably stop soon. Okay, I think we've we've spent enough time there. We've got what we could, and that's not bad. That'll keep us alive a little bit longer in an infect district, and I really need that. So I count that as a mild to moderate success. So just buy another scalpel from the pharmacy. These are all options. Perhaps they are ones that we should consider or explore. The 
day must be considered. Right, are we going to get through everything? Medicine, what do you need? How can I fix you? Could be anything. Okay. Better. Better than nothing. Okay. Notkin, Griff, Ruben's Hideout, Shady Shop. Um. We'll get these guys last. I'm sorry. I just. No, we'll get. The canes we'll have to get to last, I think. Notkin, kids, hospital. Plan, done. Right, Notkin. Fastest way to Notkin is across the bridge. And that's what we should do. Fuck it, I'm gonna take the dead items. We can drop them if we need to. Fuck! Hunger, hunger already. They weren't lying about that. Okay. Do I cure Notkin? We've seen that anyone can die to this plague. Like even if you've even if you've done some degree of prepping for it, giving them antibiotics, giving them something to quell the infection, we've seen that anyone can and probably will die. Kids. Got one already. Uh, I can just use. Oh, I can just use the lockpick as my shiv. Break this after a couple of uses, but. Okay, let's give us a look. I don't even have anything that she wants. Right. We'll save him now. To the kids. Well, actually, no. Uh, let's... Let's go get ourselves some food from the shady shop. And then go to the kids. Possibly should have kept a hold of that water bottle a little bit longer, but um, um, I'm, I'm just going to roll with it. I'm just going to roll with it. You take the mistakes and you roll forward with them. You just keep pressing forward. That's the only way to make it through this game alive with any of your senses, any of your sensibilities, any of your life intact. Fuck me. 2,000 for a loaf of bread, 1,000 for a pemmican. What we take? Generally speaking, the bigger the item, it's more likely to just fill me up for longer. Oh, fine. Uh. Wow, that was an unnecessary amount of 
tomfoolery. Well, I'm sure that's definitely going to be a good decision that won't come back to bite us later. <laughs> where is infected? Doesn't really matter, actually. We know where we're going. It's this way. We're going to the station. I think the Olgimski houses might be infected, just judging by the path that the plague spreads, but we'll see. We're going to keep the super tinctures to use as prophylaxis, because they are more effective than regular prophylaxis. Are you shitting me? Not again. Are you shitting me? Okay, right, well, we know where they're going to be infected then. Let me just check my people. Who have we not yet saved? Sabarov, uh, Keynes, and Peter Stamaton. What the hell is Khan doing out here? Okay. Iron creeps into the step. The railroad. Iron creeps into the step. Elongated things. Also rusty wheels. Train wheels and grass. Also old car parts and dilapidated factories. Oh yeah, the factory too. Turns bulls into canned meat. Same process. Is it true that the factory was a foundry first because they found copper in the step? True, but then the copper disappeared somehow because they turned it into a slaughterhouse. Me, I don't like iron. It's wicked, alien, and rusty. Iron, cold iron, shall be the master of you all. Do you know that poem? Quick train, race train, speedy, lightning fast, instantaneous. <sighs> I'm choosing the wrong names. For the train. Try swearwood. Now this is unexpected. Вот и нет больше наследницы у Катерины. I'm so pleased to see you. Please, meet Kaspar. We call him Khan. I haven't formally introduced you to him before, have I? We were just discussing our plans for the outbreak. Planning a future together, huh? I... <laughs> no, I phrased that wrong. Well, not wrong, but... Never mind. Can I be of any help? Yes, finish your conversation and go home. Can't you see we're in the middle of the conversation? You're interrupting. Why is no one ever happy to see me? You're a doctor, a brave and useful person, so I'll be patient and won't stoop to a quarrel. But do understand, Capella and I will not continue our conversation until you leave. Useful, huh? Well, I'll keep in mind, maybe I'll get a chance to brag that Kane's son deems me useful. Ooh. Oh. I would call it puppy love, but I mean, it's obviously not exactly that, because these two kids are incredibly fucking powerful kids. <laughs> One leads a gang of immune adolescents that wear dog masks and kill other adolescents, and the other... Mm. Time has become denser somehow. Can you feel it? Exhaustion makes everything a blur. It's that inquisitor woman. She made herself a nest in the cathedral, and here's the result. That's why time runs faster now, and it's denser. Why? You can tell. Where does time come from? The cathedral makes it. That's why it's always been empty. No need to crowd the place. Time can only move on freely when it's empty. And she's sitting there like a spider. She must have broken something. Not something, but someone. One of the people around the bitch. Hmm. <laughs> okay. What is that? Clothes? Oh, fuck it. Right, well, we can see there's an infection raging over there. I'm glad the younger is in danger. Bloody hell. Nothing quite goes right, does it? Right, what does he have? Another toolkit, cloth gloves, boots.
There's nothing here really that I want to just be giving away. Useless. You trade, uh, no, not trade, uh, ask for repair. Yes. Jesus. I need that much just to repair? I need to find Don't, 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 don't you dare. I swear to God. Okay. Boat tokens. I don't have any use for those. I do have use for these though. But I don't have enough to trade. Morphine. Oh. Oh. Yes, please. Thank you. Okay. our immunity isn't draining at a breakneck pace. Slightly better now that we've got those gloves. Uh, the more I die, the more that thing gets closer to us. I don't like it. I don't like it. Okay. Oh dear. Леди болтает, что Симон воскрес в этой безродной нищенке. It all failed. The isolation ward in the cathedral. The hospital and the theater. Even the cemetery is an issue now. Why do you think it failed? Is there a single person who left this hospital healthy? At least we still study the disease. The town is dying, and now this inquisitor. The powers that be know everything. They won't ever be lenient anymore. Well, then what can they do? Send the army? The army. I don't suppose they'd do that. What's the point? Just be a waste of soldiers. Cheer up. We've found the cure already. V victory is at hand. Oh, fuck me. What's going on? Hey, Gubar. The doctor's here. Our shift's over. Who are you? Grigory Gorky. Orderly number six. Even number, unfortunately. My partner. Avreli Gubar is luckier. How so? It's because suffering tears the souls in two, and death keeps an eye on such moments. <laughs> The soldier's poetry. What I'm saying is, where there's an even number, somebody dies. Even if even numbers are just unlucky. Okay, well, what's today's job? To check this exact theory. You ain't in danger, Doctor, because you're the one and only. Death avoids ones. It's afraid to prick its finger on him. All in all, you just gotta wait here for an hour until you're relieved. An hour? You got enough medicine? Any protective clothing? Even a piece of cloth would do. The air here is thick. Breathing it is like eating infection with a spoon. A really big one. No, I've got everything I need. Good. We won't lock the door out of respect. Resolve is only heroic as long as there was a choice. But uh, Dr. Burak is not the type to run away, are you? I'm not. <laughs> okay, well, um... Stay in the hospital grounds for an hour. <clears throat> oh, okay, we can play we can play this game.
It'll take a while to get to us. We just have to hide. Oh, maybe it, maybe we did. Maybe, maybe it's coming. minutes. 20 minutes? That was only 20 minutes? Fuck! Oh no, oh no, oh no, a plague has come to town. Well, I'll tell you what. Whilst this... Okay, that was a bad decision. I think upstairs is also a bad decision. I think I might have put myself into a corner. Uh... Well, yeah, I put myself into a corner here. This was a terrible decision. No, 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 no. Half an hour. Can they get to me here? Ah, oh, jeez. I can see it wandering downstairs. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna hide. Uh, a sordid play this is, where I must creeps my jackboots over the dead in order merely to avoid the clouds of death around me. I feel like I'm not dignifying those that have passed by literally walking upon their faces. It wonders and it eats. It can see us. It knows us. It, my adversary knows me well. Really? I just had to jump three times over some corpses and that's... Oh no. What do I do now? I think the answer is we, we leave. Um, we run. <sighs> Fuck. Right, we go there if there's a, if that, if that zone is still alive. There's no way out there. Stop standing in the plague district. Is there any way down? No. That's the only way down. I'm not about to run straight into a plague cloud just to satisfy a quick exit. Well. Oh shit.
This is not really what I wanted. At all. Oh, fuck me. No, 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 no. Hunger, not so soon. I was so close. Okay, Vlad. I'm gonna find you, and I'm gonna try and protect you. to try. Vlad, take this. Just take it. Maybe that'll, maybe that'll help you. Okay, I need- I make a gamble. I go in and up. And I hope that this is okay. I also need to get food anyway, so... Right. Ah, oh, fuck. Yep, they're- they're infected too. Vlad the Elder's place is infected. Vlad the Elder's dead anyway. Or at least he's going to be dead very shortly. Oh, Christ. How has my exhaustion still gone back up again? Fuck. Okay. Uh, this is going to make going to a pharmacy useless now because I won't be able to buy anything because I spent my money on food. This is going to make this fight insanely difficult. Um... Better than nothing. How do you want? I need to speak to Grief. His name's Barley. I'm in charge now. You're on Grief's throne. He's busy kneeling at the cathedral. Right after Rod is out, the slippery bastard. I own this place now, so talk to me or walk. Don't care which. Why do you run away? Don't worry, pal. We can still deal. I've got bullets and blades for anyone who can pay. Cash up front, of course. Any guns in stock? Lots, so don't go pissing me off. That's unfortunate. Fuck me. Fuck me. This is... Here. Have it. You piece of shit. I could've used a fucking shotgun. <laughs> you know something? Give me another shiv. I'll just use shivs to kill him. That's what I'll do. <sighs> okay, we go up, we try and prevent, we go in, we go in, we go across. This is getting very... This is getting very difficult, and I don't think I have the ability to keep going. For much longer. Prophylaxis rescuing. I think they're. I'm. Mm. Okay.
prophylaxis. Although I know that he's about to... From what I understand, he's probably about to go to, uh... Or something. Every weapon helps. Grief go to the cathedral. Fuck. Better than nothing. Okay, I can maybe sleep for an hour? I can't sleep in this one, can I? Oh, this all just went to shit. We can exit. That amount of immunity is not going to actually provide us enough time to exit. Okay. Then... We... I don't think I can waste more time. At least that's knocked the exhaustion back just a touch enough. in the old game, the original 2005 game, you didn't have to stay in an infected district to cure people. You could just leave. You could you, you, you could just avoid them altogether and people wouldn't, the infection you, you wouldn't be so it might go a bit more okay for you. Oh, thank God. Right. With a vengeance. Clothes, pharmacy, grocery. Grocery. Uh, hold on. Just before we do this. Is as good as we're going to be able to really get it feasibly and realistically. Exhaustion and hunger have climbed too much for me to be comfortable, though. Okay, here we go. A heart for your spindle. Thank you. What do I do with this? It's not so easy to get rid of a guilty conscience. Okay. The fund won't reward me. It's not really what I wanted. Okay. An hour. One hour. Right. Hopefully that'll be enough to get us... to the grocery, then we fucking hell.
Nuts. Capella? What does Capella want? I'm gonna try not to... Please tell me that somebody can trade with something for me. Right, well that'll do. Not that I really enjoy that particular trade, but... I need food. But there's nothing that he... Nice that I can really offer. Do I really want to trade away the second for the... Mm, no. No, I want, don't want to do that. I want to keep the water bottles. Okay. And I want to deal with this hunger before it gets immediately out of control. Fuck, why is this... Why is there a wall here? Come on. Mm. Can you, can you assholes just let me? Can you guys? <laughs> Nothing goes well. Right, I have tokens. Just give me what you have. Are you kidding me? <sighs> okay. That won't last us very long. We're going to need to really have to trade like fuck for uh, what food remains. repair some of my items. I just... I just... Well. <coughs> um. And to add to it all... Yes, yes, please. Just give me the toast. Just, just give me the toast. That'll do. I don't mind. Okay. And then we somehow need to get back all the way across here to do all of the quests on the other side of the bloody world. Okay. Um. Everyone is about as safe as I can make them. Ex I mean, they're not. They're not. I, there's not enough time to be able to save everyone. Here we go again. Happy now. Didn't expect you'd actually come. It wasn't enough. I sent people to seize him and drag him to my place, but he was long gone. So I came here to rescue the boy, but he wasn't here either. I didn't expect this from you, boss. You risk everything for your son? Help me get out of here, will you? I'll try. I'll, I'll lead the kin away from here. That's what this was all about anyway. Right. Okay. Here we go. K. 
kill on you all one body. Imagine an arm torn from a body, hanging by loose skin, unattachable. One can't cut his own arm off either, too painful, lacking will. So a yargachin is needed to cut it. It will hurt, yes. Will it be terrible, yes, but someone must do it. You know the lines, so trace them. I know many lines. A wise man follows his own, not the shortest. Do as you will. We don't care. We cannot leave this place split. We cannot start a new life torn apart. So where are these crazed ones? Here we go. Again. Right. Nope. Not upon this floor. Right, we fight him in as open a ground as we can. <laughs> One. Jesus, they hit like a fucking truck. Okay. Fuck you, Mark. Fuck you. No, sto. Burden is heavy. How can we show that? Imagine rolling a boulder uphill, muscles trembling. What do you feel? Now you're trying to trick me. Well done. And not entirely untrue. Not now, though. Now we work for real. Today's subject is attrition. Burden. Exhaustion. Work, then, without me. Your play is here. I play outside. You walk his paths. Burak's paths. And they are so very difficult. Each step drains your strength, drives you closer to death. The paths narrow, shorten. You won't be able to meander as much from now on. I walk my own path. Tell yourself, I'm exhausted. I can't take it anymore. Feels natural, doesn't it? This admission could save your life. Take pity on yourself and stop in time. No one could invent that. No, one can't admit that. You must work to yourself to your death, period. Such a paradox, to admit you're tired. Is that a step towards death? A surrender? A admission of your natural limits? Or is it a step back to whatever happens before death? What is real life? To overcome weakness, one must acknowledge it, though. Wouldn't you agree?
even at my best. Where we left off. Okay. Okay, so we need more bandages. We need to go into this fight with... We need to take... We need to learn what we can from this. Not really sure what that gave us in total. Okay, now the heart is talking to me. A bowl of cheese will do. Okay. We need to know what we're going into. We've got at least four of these guys to kill that I'm aware of. I've spotted them before. Uh, right, that'll do because it's actually going to be worth it. Stoy. Okay. I'm not about to get involved in that. Value. I need more bandages before I go in. I don't need more knives, I just need more bandages. Okay, that'll have to do. Okay, well... Now our hunger is significantly better. Right, I've got a little bit of backup. A little bit. It's not going to be enough, but it will do for now. I need some dude with a cap to trade more water, though. Okay, this area is not infected. There should be workers with caps just hanging around. I really bloody hope so, because we've only got one tourniquet. We need more. So judging by how each time I got hit there, they take a huge whack of health off. Nope, not worth it. Not worth it. You. You there. Pharmacy. I guess that'll have to do. You know what else I can do whilst I'm up here is... Oh, fuck. Okay, I can try and rescue you. I can try and rescue you too. This is going to be a difficult thing to do. Why not? Why not just pick up a little a few more items here and there for the dead item shop, just in case. Just in case. I can always use more powder, right? I mean, I burned too many before.
There he is. The little, the little fucker. Oh shit, right, okay. You better be grateful for this, you little ass hat. Is that worth it? Is this worth it? Is any of this worth it? How many people do I get to actually save? <clears throat> Time does feel like it's going faster. I didn't think it was, but... Maybe it actually is. I don't know. I don't know. Two tourniquets is not enough. You need to give me something. Okay. Just let me in. Let me in. I'll try and tra trade with somebody. I just need some healing items that I can just use stat. Come on. Is there nobody in here? You fucker, I don't want coffee. I want I want your dad to give me a bandage. This is this is terrible. This is just not going well. This is not going well. Okay, fine. F fine. Pharm pharmacy it is. Pharmacy. Okay. Uh, I swear I will get this done. Okay. Bandage. Yeah. Um. Uh Jesus. Um um Okay, yeah, that that that's actually a decent enough trade. That we'll have to do. Two tourniquets and a bandage. Will that be enough? I don't think it will. Okay. Well, let's let's hope. This might be enough now. That is all the water that I have. Uh, he's got more tourniquets, but now I don't have any more water. This guy's dead. Is there any barrels of water around to drink from before I go into this? Uh, there's a barrel over here. Christ, this is, this is a difficult journey. Oh, 
Okay, here we go. Have we armed and shivs at the ready? this I think <sighs> Jesus maybe we don't call this this is hard <laughs> already went bad. <sighs> Fuck! I swear to God. Must you? Nice meeting you, fellow traveller. How's it going? Enjoying the play? It's not going particularly well, as you can see. You don't say. The man's weird. How did it even occur to him? The person stumbles, and instead of lending a hand, he pushes them down further. Pours oil under their feet? It's completely beyond me. I think the idea is I'm supposed to value life higher because of this. <laughs> Listen, fellow traveller. I have a proposal, and I'll be blunt. Would you like to stop all this torture, the punishment? The hunger, the pain, the divine plagues of Egypt you endure for each new death. What do you mean? Exactly what I meant. I'll replace you. I'm itching to act. You'll become strong again. No more hunger pangs. The bon bony monstrosity we've all seen at the town square, it'll vanish. And you'll no longer be punished for mistakes. You're about to perish without a single achievement. Look how pale you are. No, no offense. And how would you even achieve this by, by strangling the director? Nah. I am a light technician here. Lighting the way, so to speak. Immortal will listen to me. Don't you worry about that. All you need is to give your consent. No soul required. Alright, so what's the catch? Don't say there isn't one. If we strike this deal, you'll be free to die as much as you can bear. You can become death's next door neighbor, so to speak. But in the exchange, you will lose something. Something big and important. And I won't tell you what it is. It might hurt incredibly. Or not at all. Give me what you don't know you have at home. Yeah, I've, I've heard this one. Pull the cloth out of your brains and think about it. Hard. These aren't just words. I am taking something from you. The real you. No huge loss, though. Maybe. But you'll be free to walk around the town. Take risks, get into fights, be daring. Deal. Not for myself, but to get better at helping of this. All these shackles slow me down. Are you sure? You won't be able to change your mind or rewind time. The choice you make now will stay with you till the end. I'm sure. No more penalties for death. Uh. 
This is a Faustian deal if ever there was one. Taking the deal. No more penalties for death in exchange for something. Well, fellow traveler, you've made your choice. Go out there, and I will act. I feel uneasy. I'm taking it. I'm taking the deal. This time. We have to make it. We have to make it this time. Right? We can't just not. Sorry, did I did I already already signed a treatment for him for today? Did I take a bad deal? Do I ever know? What is being taken away from me? The real me. Me? The real me? The real me? Is that Artemi Burak? Or is that Sulmatul? Is the real me the character or the one playing the character? What am I supposed to take from this? Am I supposed to value life more now that I understand what life means? What it means to be without life? What it means to see people die. What have I taken? What deal did I strike? Will this deal be good enough to save me? I don't think it will. I don't know why that first lockpick broke, though. On our, on our past goddamn attempt. My interpretation as to what is being said is that the thing that is being taken away is the experience that you will see, you, the viewers, will see me, Somatol, under, undergo. You're, you're missing out on seeing me suffer more by me taking that deal. That is my. That is my main interpretation from that. My main and only interpretation at the time of uh, recording. I'm sure I'm wrong. I'm sure I have missed something very important. But I guess we'll find out what that important thing is when I fuck up again. Which, at this point, is inevitable. <sighs> the combat is really, really hard. really know how to I don't know how to handle any of this I think I just made the wrong decision I think I may have screwed something up awfully well one more time huh Go. He's on the 
this floor, wasn't he? Well, we have a solution. We stab him in the back. One apostate is dead, there are more. This is far more preferable than repeated deaths at the hands of these worms. Okay. This is the best we've done so far. Okay. One more will be enough. I'll get the message. Oh, thank God. We're nearly done. So close, we are so, so close. And oh, if I die now, I'm gonna be so sad. No, don't you exhaust in me. Don't you dare exhaust in me. <laughs> don't you dare. You fuckers, I have got too much to go for. Okay. But combat rewards being aggressive when you're holding knives. You go in and you, st you try and stun lock them. Where, where is this last one? Where's it gone? around here. Yes, there he is. <laughs> yes. After all this. After everything. Oh, screw off. I don't care about my loss of reputation right now. I have fucking proved myself to the kin. I... I deserve this. 
I deserve some goddamn respect. I did all of this for you, fuckers. Are we whole again? Yes, we hear it. We are whole again. I hope so. Go to Shachin. That's why I part before you. Did you accept your power over us? Are you your father now? I have, by killing those poor souls. You forced my hand. By Allah, Isegir. We thank you for what you have done for our body. You are a Yargachin. You are an Emushin. What is in a dirk, Katanga? I want to hear an answer from some... I want to hear an answer from everyone who knows the word. Polish, Polish. Why do you ask? I am but the king's hangnail, a fleck of their skin. I don't know that. Who does then? A mother superior? A six-year-old child? No. Then ask everyone you can. Fine. You'll leave this poisonous grave now and soon. Otherwise the last person who might remember anything will die. We will talk later. How are you feeling there, boss? The survivors left for Shechem. Boss. Boss, come on. Can't get him out. At least he won't come out. Right. Do I have a boat token? I do not have a boat token. You know something? I'm gonna just give this my best. Nah. do much more. I don't have the skill. What is this? A matchstick I left on the floor. I'm sorry, Alexander Sabarov, but I think you're gonna have to have to accept that I'm not gonna get to you. Oh, fuck. Okay, so combat rewards. The aggressive. I wish I had a boat token. I wish. I wish I still had something left over. Okay. Just, I wish the day is the the day is kind of running out from me. Everything's really falling apart. It's already eight p.m. Can I get to the other side in town? Can I get in time? Can I get there in time? What should I have done in in the hospital? Should I have stayed longer? Should I have allowed myself to become infected? Was that what that was about? No one came to relieve me. Everyone is dead. I still have time. Fuck, I should maybe just scuff some coffee beans? Reduce the exhaustion just at least a tad. Maybe that, maybe that would be a... Kid. 
Right, good, I need... Twire there, but I'm 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 just gonna keep moving. I'm sorry, guys. I'm too I'm too broken. <sighs> I think I just picked easy mode on the repeated deaths. I think I just dismissed something important. That'll do. If it lets me stay awake for at least a little bit longer, then maybe. Maybe. Maybe that's enough. <sighs> maybe it'll be enough that I can just... <sighs> I don't have much more diagnostics in my pack. beginning to run very low on any of my resources that I need to help people. So I'm going to probably take a gamble when I get to these two. I desperately hope that whatever I do will pay off. I have, I have a gamble here. And that gamble is going to be, I'm just going to go in and try and give them the right antibiotic and hope that I get the right one. Kid doesn't have anything I want. Or I don't have anything the kid wants even. enjoying the prospect of any of this. Is the town calling to me because there's something in the cathedral? <clears throat> Is that what it's trying to tell me? Just go to the cathedral? I don't know. But I guess I'll find out. I don't need you today, Doctor. I've made some progress. Report. Oh Yun, the foreman of the abattoir, is back from the steppe. He might know something. Your Oh Yun knows nothing. He tried to find those brontosauruses of yours in the steppe, only to learn they're extinct. Any more bright ideas? I need to go to the abattoir. I've always wanted to. Do you know what you'd be looking for? Or is it just a shot in the dark? I'm relying on Oh Yun. He, he promised to find out. You have no time for hope and luck, Barak. No time at all. And tell me what to do. No. Doctor, are you a courier, an aide, an assistant, a secretary? Or else did you see my point to you in one location with all the answers and all you'd have to do is stroll over? You're an inquisitor. You, you know more than I do. Maybe you found a lead. Those who can only follow crosses on a map have already received my orders. They're of no interest to me. And they won't solve our problem. I'm relying on those who can think for themselves. Don't disappoint me. The cross is in the abattoir, but I don't know how to get inside. Oh, there he is. Griff, why are you here? Yeah. What are you doing here? Thinking. Something's off about you. We had a talk. I thought it'd be an interrogation. But no, we just talked for two hours. She was faster than me. We're all toys, Cav. Just toys. Puppets. You go about living and breathing and all that. Not a thought spare for your place in it all, but... Actually, you're pulled around by great strings. 
You think you're alive, but you ain't, pal. You, you, you just ain't. We've got no right to call ourselves people. Hmm. When did you become such a philosopher? Nothing to do with philosophy. We're all just filled with cotton. You aren't. You're filled with clockwork. She knows what she's saying. She's a professional. She really is. I, I haven't figured it all out. Not yet. But I've seen the light, Cab. I don't want to live like this. People who see the light gain the will to live. I suspect it wasn't like that. By the way, if you could, could you drop by my warehouse? Just check on the guys. Tell them to lock the place up and scatter. Tell them I said so. Tell them a long beak packs millet. They'll listen. Well, they'll listen to you anyway. They know you. Perhaps you should do it yourself. I can't do anything. Not from here. We've run all out of old grief. All right. Pay them a visit then, for the sake of a dear old friend. There's too much to do still. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm just just gonna leave that body. Just just gonna leave it there, are we? Please tell me you got something. No. Please tell me you you've got something. No, I need my boat token. Fuck you. God damn it. Okay, we're going to save the game quickly. Touch clocks. Touch clocks to save the game. The cathedral itself is a giant clock. What's... There is a mystery there left unsolved. I... I'm going to go back into the cathedral when I have time and see what what's going on. The cathedral's got a giant pendulum, right? If the cathedral has a giant pendulum, then it is a giant clock. It literally produces time. It produces save state. The cathedral is... The cathedral will save us all? Crying kids, I'm... less interested in right now. I've got too much to run. Broken ribs. They lie upon the ground. Fuck off! No! It's not your place to do this to me. doing? Capella, what are you doing? Capella, don't, don't. Oh, fuck, Capella. You came because you sensed me thinking of you. Inadvertently, I touched you with my thoughts, and it isn't the first time. Why? Scattered thoughts and anxieties pop into my head, because we're connected, you and I. I'm sorry you have to hear them sometimes. That's my mother awakening inside me. I can't help it, because I see you. What else do you see? Tell me now, please, instead of barging into my head. I see that you and I have different paths. You're about to do something terrible and destroy all the children. How so? I had a dream yesterday. All our children lay on the ground and a white flower grew from each of their heads. You'd watch them when they were sad and sometimes pick leaves from for them for your potions. Then a cart ran over them all, and its wheels ground them into dust. Someone else is coming to town. Death in an iron cart. Actually, you're right. Death is coming to our town in an iron cart. Precisely. So you see these dreams too? Death, death came to our town a week ago. I'm taking them from you, the ones you took care of. I'll do it now, and I'll do it better. T taking them? What do you mean? When... When the trouble comes from them... Let me be the one to shield them, not you, all right? I'll speak to it myself. Speak to what? Victoria, there's an outbreak. To save anyone, I need to work and make the cure, not argue abstract ideas. Have you made it already, then? Are you like that big, fancy city doctor claiming all we need to spell salvation is chemistry? 
He's a non-believer, but you're a better man. You know the world is more complicated than that. So believe me. Believe what? You can't look after them all as I do. They'll die if they remain your wards, because you're still so far from understanding. You can't sense the town as I do. I'm taking them from you. You're in danger too, you irresponsible girl. You'll be the first to die. No. Even if I die, I'll still linger. In them. In you all. Even in you yourself. I have seen that too. What do you mean you'll linger in me? Like intruding my thoughts even after you die? Perhaps. I still hope that was just my intuition. That you just have an overly active imagination. Still. We're too different, you and I. I will always be your ally, but we aren't friends. I'm sorry. I've had enough of this nonsense. Everyone who trusted their lives to me remains under my protection, and that includes you. Uh... How much time have we got? Not a lot. The next act's going to be a big one. Um, okay. I need a lot more. How did I use so many potions so quickly? Yet. Keep chasing me, please. Okay. Two. Okay, right, we're gonna go in, we're gonna save the game, and we're gonna just... Please tell me you're still somewhere in here. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that was luck. That was... That was luck. Oh god. Alright, we're gonna do the same again, I guess. To, had to fail at least once. <sighs> My luck couldn't last forever. We've done all we can. And I don't have the resources anymore to do much more. Where's the button? I, I just... Let me, let me across. Let me do what I can. Fuck me. Okay. 
Well, one fingernail is used now, too. I need it. We won't accept you in our boats for one anymore. Fuck! Why? We line our boats with fingernails to make the path smoother. You have become burdensome and cool. Too much death, too much trouble in your chest. Too heavy for a boat to carry. We need two fingernails. One was enough to carry my burdens before. You didn't carry a whole town on your back before. I don't have to. Right. Okay, I guess we're just running then. <sighs> oh, fuck. Everything is kind of falling apart. <sighs> Fuck, it's empty. Down and out. We don't go through the plague districts. That, that would be a terrible idea. Plague is burning on. Uh, um, fuck. Am I going to get there in time? I don't know if I will get there in time. Christ. I think I'll just get there in time, but barely. I swear, if this opens up another quest line, I won't be able to do it. From here, what do we do? Where do we go? <coughs> we go... We go to the theatre, we go to the hideout. I think that's the best solutions that we have. Or we go and crash at Lara's place. Oh God, this is not going well. I don't want to die again. I get the impression if I die again, things are just going to get a lot worse. What do I owe the pleasure? A long beak pecks millet. What's this bullshit? Grief says hi. Go away, lock the warehouse, and don't take anything with you. You got a death wish? Do you? What a quick boy you are. Bad grief's pal, huh? Well, bad grief's done, and I am in charge now. Get out of this warehouse. I'm asking nicely. Trust me, I'm a doctor. Well, I'm the one who drew the first knife. Ever heard of Barley the Barber? So those are your old men that are cutting peaceful folk at night. He's gonna stop us now. Whose lore is it? Forbidden knives. I'm done with your step preaching. Done. We are free people. If we want to cut folks, we'll cut folks. I dare you to stop us. Oh, I will attack. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> okay, well, I mean, I guess I'm... Oh, no, 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 no. Fuck you all. That's it. There's no one here anymore. The theater's closed. We're all sick of it, literally nauseated. Closed? How? 
Clearly not closed well enough since you're here anyway. But everyone else is gone. Where? How should I know? I'm just a junior prop designer. No one reports to me. But the theatre is empty now. Do not come back. So there won't be any more pantomimes at night? Pantomimes? Uh, oh, oh, pantomimes. No, there will still be pantomimes. They're there, you see. I'm talking about here. So that's what the fellow traveller took from me. Philosophy discussions. Oh, could have been worse. Thieves rarely take a single coin. They usually grab the whole purse. Just saying. Just saying the talks with the director aren't the only thing I've lost. What have I got myself into? Yep, I made a bad decision. One of many, won't be the last. Christ. Well, that was a terrible quest line to follow. Why did I bother doing that? That was a surefire way to die. Oh well. I don't actually remember which one it was now. Oh well, I chose the wrong one anyway because I'm a twat. Are we going to try that again? <sighs> that was a bad decision and I think I fucked up by... Oh, Christ, I just want to leave. Okay, well, let's do that again. This is, this is painful. This is actually painful. Also, how did I choose the wrong antibiotic again a second time in a row? This isn't my day job. I shouldn't get in trouble for this in a game. I already get in trouble in that enough in my real life. Antibiotic resistance is a thing. That's what I'm going to blame it on. Antibiotic resistance. Uh, it's it's just it's just I used the the wrong antibiotics too much before, and now the plague is resistant to to the antibiotics I'm using. Clearly, that's what's going on here. I just bred a resistant strain. It's, it's not me being an idiot. I promise. It's me being an idiot. I'm an eternal fucking idiot. Um, and also, this child is directly in the way of my Twirin. There we go. So we're going to try that again. Death should not have taken me. I'm sad that we lost our discussion to the director, actually. And that little bony thing growing out of the ground, what was that for? Well, that's a mystery we will now never find out. Life is full of mysteries that we never really find out. The completionist in me, of course, is sad. But uh, the completionist in me is also an idiot. Um, and uh, is entirely unsuitable for doing anything further. Right, you know what we're going to do? We're going to go in here and we're going to save before we have that conversation again. Because fucking hell. I'm, I'm not willing to uh, engage in that discourse once more. There's no save clock in here. Oh, fuck. No... Hmm. 
not take up. Nothing I want. Okay. Done an our book. He bowed before the commissar, wench, and licked her boots voluntarily. Couldn't have done a worse if he tried. He's a mutt, not a leader. Which would make you the leader, correct? Well, I'm the one who drew the first knife. Ever heard of Barley the Barber? Leave metal, right? Who's gonna stop us now? Whose law is it forbidding knives? I'm done with your step preaching. Done. We're free people. If we want to cut folks, we'll cut folks. I dare you to stop us. Fuck you all. I may have really messed. That was not a good way to have played that. But, uh, you know something? I'm gonna take what I can. <laughs> I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna roll with it. Package. I'm... I, I may have cheesed that. Did that package just contain another package? Well, okay. You know something? I killed Barley. Grief's all business is over. Oh no, I can't go all the way back there with 20 minutes to go. Christ. Right. I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna buy a lemon. <laughs> <coughs> I hope to fuck that he has a lemon left. Because otherwise this is gonna get super hard. No, he doesn't. Uh, coffee. For an extortionate price. But I have the money, so, you know. Screw it. Eh. Drinking coffee is bad for your health, kids. Genuinely, uh, that amount of caffeine is not really very good for you. Um, it will mess around with your, um... 20 minutes, literally 20 minutes. I just, I need to get back to grief. I can do this. Fucking hell. Because I made some mess of that hospital quest. I don't know what I did wrong. Right, who's... Are you shitting me? Right, another death on our souls. No, don't kill him. Can I could have could have saved him? <sighs> Are you shitting me? <laughs> Are you actually shitting me? They're all di they're all they're all dying. Yulia, please. Wow, 
театре маски репетируют новую пантомиму. I lost Nokin. I lost one of the kids I was supposed to be trying to... I, t I tried. I tried. I did everything I actually could. I really... I tried. Everything that was within my power to do was done, and it wasn't enough to save to save another child. Fuck! How many are gone? One, two, three, four, five. Six. I mean, Vlad is... Vlad, Vlad is dead. <sighs> Can I even go to, into Eva's house anymore? Don't. Oh, please. <laughs> no. How did everything go so wrong? Going, I, <laughs> I, I really just wanted to save the child. What's Zalitila Warona of Tsarski Haruma? Yes, what have you done to him? I, mean, I didn't do anything. Does he bother you? No, did you interrogate him? I have a unique approach to each person in regards to Griff. Can't you see that the man is thinking, changing, even be? What was he babbling about puppets? Did you tell him about that? No. He figured that out on his own. Is that true? It's true for him. I don't know about you. Am I different somehow? You are unlike anyone I have ever seen. Freer than other men. As though your strings are pulled by some manner of God. Thanks, I guess. It's almost like... I'm, uh... Are you... Ah, uh, shit. Griff's in here. Griff's in here and he's in danger. Well, you stop thumping? You look like a question mark, not a person. Locked up the way, Griff. Bash a number of heads in. So what, you want a treat and a pat in the head? Hope you didn't strain a muscle, muscle bash in theirs. It's fun, I'm used to it. Did... Did my salvation come at the cost of you getting your hands bloody? Dirty business. You know what? Here. Have this gun. It'll at least help keep things cleaner next time. Maybe. Is this a shotgun? I never thought you weren't a murderer after all. It's a good gun, I suppose. I never checked. I only carried it for show, so they'd fear me. It's not how it works, you know. They won't try anything as long as they're afraid. Won't get cocky, won't make you rein them in. 
I'll make you use the gun. Sly. A noble, even, in a way. I guess I'm not a villain anymore. My conscience is burning like a witch. Never been a villain. A crook, sure, but not a villain. Here's what I'm thinking, Cap. God gave you golden hands, so you became a healer. If you had bare paws, you'd be a gravedigger. Why'd your old man send you away? Because you're a successor. I'm naturally talented to boot. You catch my drift? I think so. The point being, you never had a choice. Your path was tailored for you with a pretty bow on top. But who's the tailor, Cap? Who? I don't know either. Fate? What do you think of your fate? I used to be a thief, yet they made me a storekeeper. What a perfect fit I made. I got my warehouse kingdom, and with it, the insides of the town's great machine. I kept Vlad's riches whilst having all I could dream of. I can't imagine a sweeter life. So what in the world are you unhappy about? Was I tailored for that life then? Fit was perfect. Fit was perfect. What are you doing here? You can go back to the warehouses. I don't want it anymore. I don't want that fate. I want a choice. Only I'm tangling from a string cap, just like you. We're bound. So what would you have us do? Run away, hoping the strings tear? Well, I know I didn't run far. The moment the grip loosened, I stopped and... Well, here I am. Sitting nice and quiet. To hell with your freedom, then. Aglaia, can I... No, Aglaia is not... Infectable. That people are not going to come to to Saba's place anymore. She's dead. Broken city we walk. I'm gonna do my best to. I'm gonna do my best. Go and see the pantomime. We'll go to Lara's place and, um... <sighs> fuck. God fucking damn it, this was a disaster of a day. Like, fucking everyone died. All of them. Just, just all of them. And yet... Oh, fuck, this is not going good. The cancer is at least cut out of the town. with a bad feeling about all of this. Oh shit, nothing awaits me in the fund. Говорят, он умеет беречь людей на войне. Но что значит беречь людей? Ведь их не построишь в колонну и не уведешь туда, где не стреляют и не бомбят и где их не могут убить. Не подвергать их бессмысленной опасности, без колебаний бросая навстречу опасности необходимой. Вот что значит беречь людей на войне. А мера этой необходимости действительной, если ты прав, и мнимой, если ты ошибся, на твоих плечах и на твоей совести. Здесь на войне не бывает репетиций. Когда можно сыграть сперва для пробы, не так, а потом так, как надо. Генерал, вы о чем? Тут не война. 
у вас же прямой приказ остановить мор. То есть не беречь людей, а именно что убивать. Это преступный приказ. И я не стану его выполнять. Да, роль у вас незавидная. Но давайте попробуем еще раз. С другой вашей реплики. I wonder what that foreshadowing could possibly, possibly mean. Fuck it. Guess we've got a shotgun now. Maybe that'll come in handy. To Lara's. I think it's the only safe place. Safe is a very comparative term here. <coughs> Dead item shop is down there. It's, that is far away. Shit. Who can I even save? Can we still go into the mansion? Can we still save the game in there? Is it worth taking that risk? too many of them. At least I can outrun them. This person is... Everybody's dying. Everybody is dying. No! Leave me be. I guess this is where we end this. I'm so sorry, everyone. I, I, I genuinely did as much as I could. I'm sorry, I know it wasn't enough. Good night.